Hey guys, how's it going? Shadow Scotty here, and uh, today, as you can tell by the title of the video, I am bringing you a uh, new sort of funny video called Bobblehead Bosses. And um, anyway, so yeah, one of my friends, uh, Toxic Zombie, he managed to get a thousand completed waves of Horde, which at the time, at the, like by now, is slightly ridiculous. The fact that he's already completed a thousand waves of Horde, seeing as the game came out like a few weeks ago, but um, yeah, so he got that, and that gives you the uh, Bobblehead Mutator. Big head mutator, and um, not only does this give me big heads, it also gives all the opponents big heads, including the bosses, and also gives us little squirrel voices, which is kind of funny, kind of cute, little jokes. Um, yeah, Marcus sounds like a bit of a derp, but anyway. Um, so today I'm going to show you bobble the bobblehead bosses. Now, um, the grinder might as well be a friggin' boss. It's as big as one. If you look at it, you should probably see it sometime soon. It has the biggest gun you will ever see. So. I'll just start here on uh, wave 20, and here you can see the grinder in the background has the friggin' biggest gun you will ever see. It's ridiculous. Now here is the uh, gunkers. So as you can see, they have quite a large, hideous, hideous head. So that is the bobblehead gunker right there. And uh, we die here. This is on insane, by the way. So yeah, we got. Uh, we ended up getting one to 50. So that was good. Okay, and here wave 20 again. We see another boss wave. And I'm pretty sure this is Gunkers again. And there's no point buying any upgrades because it does absolutely nothing anyway. But, um, yeah. So, just walking around. That's Marcus there. He sounds so stupid. It's the funniest thing. When you have active reload and stuff, they say say stuff that's all in squirrel voices. It's pretty funny. I would recommend getting the Mutator if you can, if you have the patience and time to get a thousand, um, Thousand completed ways of horde. I think I got like 270 or something. I, I do play a bit of horde. I try. Plus, it took a while to finish. Now, also, I'm I'm using the mutated insta give melee and super reload, which I got myself. Boom! There we go. Gunker down. Insta give melee pretty much means you one hit melee everything. Or oh, if you saw it on the side there, there was the grinder with the massive, massive grinder. And look at the freaking drudge. <laughs> look at him. Giant head. And here we have, yeah, see there's a grinder over there in the distance. You probably can't see his gun from here, but yeah, they look ridiculous. Now, I will be bringing you corpses now. And the corpses look, oh no, wait. Here we go, this is different. Um, okay. So we have a berserker. A really, really, really annoying berserker. A glowy, the glowy berserker. Look at it, oh, that thing is ugly. That thing's hideous. It's a shame you can't one-hit melee these guys, because that's disappointing. You can one-hit melee the Drudges and the Berserkers. Those are the only two, which is slightly annoying. But, you know, deal with it. Pretty much to get to wave 50 on Horde and Insane, we had to wait till uh, Berserker rounds, just wait for them to come to us. It was kind of hard. I can't imagine trying to do it without mutators, but yeah. By the way, to get insta melee, you have to kill 200 people as a wretch, which is... It's, it's fairly difficult, to be honest. It, uh, it's, it takes some serious time, but if you you sort of get the hang of it, it takes about an hour or two, I guess. And then you can also get uh, Super Reload by active reloading 2,500 times, which isn't that bad, that just happens as you play. As, as long as you active reload most of the time, which I do. But, yeah. So, at the moment you can still see this Lambent Zerk, who's, who's a pretty ugly thing, actually. With his giant head and his hoogly boogly. Okay. Oh, head snake. That's not good. That is, oh, mauler. That thing looks ugly too. I mean, it looked ugly enough before, but now it's just ridiculous. Yeah, that thing looks really ugly. All right, now we see corpses, savage corpses. These things are the biggest pain in Horde. I swear, they're like the hardest boss. Then the easy boss is actually berserkers. So you know. Now these guys, you, you don't really notice the big head as much on these guys. It's sort of more of a passive thing. But yeah, it's definitely there. And you can't melee these guys either with the insta give, which is kind of disappointing because you, you would think you'd be able to. But you know, whatever, I guess that's just how it goes. Insta give melee does make it pretty friggin' easy. Now at the moment we got two of them coming at us pretty quick. We don't finish like any of these waves, just letting you know. Because, I mean, it's pretty difficult when you're on insane, you, no matter what mutates you have on. I mean, infinite ammo would probably help, actually. But, yeah. 
So you see the grinder over there? That guy, that gun is just ridiculous. The boomers have it as well, but it's not as exaggerated as the grinders. Those things just have the most ridiculous guns. And if you didn't know, you can actually chainsaw the uh, Savage Corpse's face. Not that it does like any damage whatsoever. But you can do it. Now, there's the grinder still. I think we're about to lose it, but you know, that's just how things go. Oh, okay. I'm down. I am down, that is for sure. Oh, jeez. I just got flailed. That is not friendly. That's so not cool. So uncalled for. Now we have the Berserkers. These things are funny. And the only round you can actually win on. Okay, so this is the, the end of the video pretty much, guys. And I'll, uh... Post some more up vids. Sorry if you guys didn't like this. It was sort of just a quick sort of I need to make some more videos. And I'll uh, catch you guys later. I hope you enjoyed it.